Hello, and welcome to my Drifters Challenge. Um, let's see. Um, on the last episode that I did for this challenge, I um, ended up getting Christina engaged and pregnant. Um, and I thought that something didn't feel quite right with the way I was doing that because Z does not live with her yet. Um, so, uh, if you watched the last part, I did ask, I, I was asking, wait, am I doing this right? Like, is there any rules? And I was looking in the rules and I couldn't find anything. I guess I didn't go down far enough, but Vi did inform me that the father has to be living in the house. Whoever the heir is, um, the father of the heir is, has to be living in the house. So I did it a little backwards and I'm so sorry about that. I hope it doesn't like ruin my game or anything. <laughs> but what I'm going to do this episode, hopefully she does not go into labor um, just yet. Uh, Z works at two o'clock so and she works at wait okay uh actually she's off but i don't think he is mm, no <sighs> yeah so um what we're going to do is try to get Z over in the morning because I was also informed that the day that he came over so very angry, um, it was probably because I was making him miss work. But I'm trying to get things moving here. I've been on house one way too long. So I am making, I did make a few mistakes along the way, but we're good from here on out. So without, um, further ado, let's go ahead and um, get this going. Also, before I start, oh, walls down. I did move the garden, but um, mm, I'm probably going to move it to the front. Uh, these were all really good suggestions. So I'm probably going to move it to the front. Um, uh, when I have it on something else. So let's just get moving. Hopefully she does not have the baby before I can get um, Z over to live in the house. Um, because yeah. I, I played just a little in between, and so now she's in her third trimester. And I didn't even, you know, think about that, that she would have to um, have him living in the house, which should not be a problem at all. But I, I just wanted to make sure I was doing it right, and I wasn't. So <laughs> we'll get that fixed as soon as possible. Oh, she's huge. All right, so let's have her go to the bathroom. It's eight o'clock. I'm not sure if it's too early to call Z, but we'll give it a shot. And let's see how it goes. I, I felt like something was wrong. I was like, wait a minute, this doesn't, feel right, like something's not right here. What's going on? Oh good, he'll be right over, yay. And we'll make sure to have him out of the house if he does not move in before two. We will have him in before, have him out and going to work before then. So let's see, invite in. Of course, if they get married, he moves in. Why is he so angry when he comes over? When 
and somebody to build a baby. Uh, I'm not sure. Um, Computer's going a little slow. I don't know why that is. There it is. Ask to move in. Yay! This could be a little easier than I thought. Okay. Yay! He's moving in. Now, um, she was $28 <laughs> because I did some things to her house and she has $28. So whatever Z brings to the house, we won't be keeping. Okay, so it was uh, Vi, Christina, Homie, and Z. Well, we're going to transfer Z and I don't think he's going to bring any money in because this is household has more than one person in it. So I don't think he can take the little $1,500 that he has anyway. So we're going to go ahead and move Z in. Now, of course, when Z moves in, I cannot control any of his actions. I can't send him to work. I can't get him to complete any of his goals. I can't do any of that stuff. So. Okay, so here we are. We are back and we have Z all moved in. Yay, I fixed it. <laughs> okay, so um, he's moved in. She's due to have the baby at any minute. Um, and it's still 10 o'clock or just 10 o'clock. Well, 9.45. So, um... My next step is to have them married. Um, wow, that's, yeah, that's a weird looking stomach she's got there. Look at the shape of her stomach. <laughs> oh my goodness. Looks like a sideways watermelon or something. I don't know. I bet her back does hurt with a stomach like that. Anyway, okay, um, yeah, so, um, yeah, it's her day off, but he has to work, so, uh, let's see, now that I've got that fixed, let's cook breakfast, we'll have her cook breakfast. Um, where's the eggs and toast? Or maybe a BLT? Yeah, we'll do a BLT. Nope, eggs and toast. Oh, if I could not be indecisive, it would make things go so much easier. Okay. And, um, when she's done, oh, I didn't even check to see if she brought in anything, so I'm glad or he brought it or anything. I'm glad he didn't because I sure didn't check it. All right, when, he's, when she's done cooking, we're going to water the plants and harvest all. And then, um, You know what? It's her day off. So she's got to go look for something. Oh, jeez. Mm. Okay, guys. Suggestive conversation. What are you two talking about over here? We've been on for five minutes, and that's what happens. Okay, go ahead. Go cook. And then... um. She's going to water 
and weed the plants, I guess. Because we don't have enough to paint. So we're just going to kind of... Hmm. Maybe just look around. See what she can find. And, um... I don't really want to do the fishing thing. But, what is this? Because she's running low on plants here. What is this? Sage. I guess I should go check and see what she has first, but we'll do that in just a second. All right. All right, we'll get it anyway. Harvest. I don't, oh, there they are. Well, what is wrong? She's hungry. Okay. Did she cook? Hmm. Well, just for this quick thing here, we're gonna have her just eat what's in here. Oh, uh, you know what? Does he think give her a kiss before work? Not too late. I didn't want to have the gap. So now it's like. Let's just leave it like that. I'll fix it um, shortly. What is going on here? Okay. Well, now she can paint. Oh. I said once I did this, I was going to bring her um, plants around front, or at least closer to the front, so she's not killing the plants, because I truly, truly think that's getting on Vi's nerves. <laughs> My plants, she was so happy about the plants, and then um, I kind of let the plants just die, I guess. And that was because I wasn't sure if I was going to go through the hassle of keeping them. But I'll keep them. And we'll just stick them over here for now. At least they'll be closer. And then we can take care of them more. There. All right. Oh, um, I didn't, I, I didn't. This is the baby's room. I haven't done anything to the room because we don't know whether she's having a boy or a girl. Um, but I did add the baby's room and I did a little kitchen over here so um to get the house a little bit more the way that you know i wanted it um so it says right now the lot value is fourteen thousand one hundred and eighty two but i think you're supposed to go out and then come back in but i didn't add or oh i did delete things so it's probably going to be just a little different let's see should have added something in its place, but that's okay. Let's see. Lots. Yeah, it went down to 13000 So, we got to get to moving. All right. So, there we go with that. Wait. 
What's up with the windows? Oh, that's the bathroom window. Okay. All right, so Z is gonna go to work soon. She is about to use the bathroom on herself. Oh, jeez, no, oh my goodness. Oh, use the bathroom. We had her refrigerator all boarded up almost. <laughs> Nobody could get in. She was starving, standing there staring at the refrigerator, but because the counters were so close, um, she couldn't get in her refrigerator. All right, let's get her in a good mood. Um, we didn't even get her around to do anything. So let's, uh, she's too hungry to dig. Okay. So Z, should be off to work. Oh. Back to Christina so I don't accidentally. Okay. We'll dig for treasure. And then dig. With my luck, she'll probably go into labor while she's doing this. the baby before the end of this part but um, I don't know if I'm going to be able to because um, my time is kind of sort of up here's a lemon tree I let my little lemons go too. I have lemons and apples. And it was mainly because I was getting her more into the painting. But I like the gardening. Let's see if she can find a frog. Anthem and we can sell that. No baby yet. I don't see the sign. And the message hasn't popped up, so no baby yet. Mm. All right. Oh, there's some more over here. She's going to have to go to the bathroom soon. We'll get as much of this done as we can and then send her home to tend to her own little garden. Seems to take forever to get her to these rocks and then to get whatever's inside the rocks takes even longer. Oh, she's given up on everything. She says, no, 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 she's too uncomfortable. Okay, let's go back to the house. Let her use the bathroom before this turns into a bad scene. Oh, too late. Okay, take a shower, sweetie. Let's see what she got. Seminite for 60. Lemon trees, tomatoes, what fish did she get? A leopard frog. Cool, let's breed those. Okay. Got that. Okay, I'm not thinking she's going to go into labor on this one. don't want to keep it too long. <laughs> Z, really, you are home now, so. All right, we're going to let her go ahead and go to sleep. 
and we'll bring this part to a close. So hopefully on the next episode, she'll have the baby. Um, yeah, so we fixed everything on this episode. I'm so sorry about it. I did not mean to mess it up. I didn't, I didn't even think about it. I was in just such a hurry to get her an heir. I didn't even think about the order that it was supposed to happen in until she was already pregnant. So I do apologize. Um, but don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe if you haven't already. Um, and until the next part, which will be very soon. Bye.